Absolutely. So we're going to just go through some memories throughout your career. And just tell me, you know, the memories that you have and maybe a quick story to go along. So here's the first one from Talladega last year. Oh, that's the one that got away, man. Yeah. Um, trying my butt off to, to beat the finger uh, through there. But, man, what a... What a great day for GMS. Um, that was that was one of our best days as an organization. I think run one, two, three, four um, all day long. Really had Talladega locked up. And you know, if, if you got to lose one, uh, losing to a guy like Grant, you can't ask for better. That was good for us. Yeah. Hey, you can go that one. <laughs> this was a good one. Um, again, had a really great truck all day. You know, I, I come off of road courses. Um, when I first started, that was that was the kind of racing I first ever got into. So it's always kind of come more naturally to me. Um, and some guys, but man, that was a that was a really good day too. What a great paint scheme too. Is that one of your favorites? It really did look cool. It was always yeah. very distinctive. You can see this thing on the racetrack, man. Mm -hmm. It is uh, what you call vibrant. Yes. Oh gosh, yeah, that's right. We had uh, this is Watkins Glen, so we were in our our backup car here with a brake failure in our first car. But this was a good learning day for us too. It's the first time I'd ever seen Watkins Glen, and it's it uh, it made me really appreciate why it's considered such a great track in the pantheon of tracks that we have it was a it was a kick-ass day I oh eldora yeah Heck yeah man this week <laughs> i love getting dirty um i'm gonna go there and watch that that was a that was a cool race last year um so that's kind of the problem with dirt once you're committed to a direction you sort of can't really change lanes or stop they don't work that well then but um you know again if i'm not mistaken this was another year gms victory larson won it with us here so that was really cool to be around for as well. Maybe another one that got away for you. Was your last one here? Shoot. <laughs> Is this Texas? No, that's Chicago. Yeah. Um, Chicago fought it out up front all day long, just couldn't get it done. But this uh, this is the same truck that we took to Texas that we um, won the pole with as well and had it won. We were just, we were flying. Anytime we had this um, paint scheme on, this mm -hmm. purple paint scheme, that was kind of our running joke was yeah. the uglier we got the truck, the faster we would go. Because okay. every time we had this paint scheme on, it, we, we were flying. Okay, we're gonna go back on the screen here to your Arca win back oh, in Kansas. Awesome. If you could just man, I got a good job. That was uh, that was an interesting race. We started dead last, uh, had to come up through the field. Um, got a good pit stop late, I think, that put us put us out to the lead. And yeah, here on this last restart, um, you know, it's kind of the restart you always dream about. You just get to check out, and everyone else is fighting hard behind you. But that was that was a lot of work. That was my last Arca start. Um, so. You know, at the end of this race, Grant was a champion, and I got to win it. So that was that was really amazing to see. Um, that was a big, big moment for us as a team. But yeah, here it is, checkered flag, man. That's what it's all about, right there. It's all that matters. Pretty rad burnouts, I guess. Yeah. Not half bad, if I do say so myself. I kept at it for a while. It's celebration. I was I was excited. Yeah. Uh, my celebration was uh, a pretty good one there. I thought, oh yeah, burn them down, Spencer. Yeah. <laughs> that was a good time. Man, that was. That was just such a long time coming. Been working hard at the Arca stuff forever, and we got to uh, got to pull one off. Yeah. So looking back on your whole career, you know, when it comes to trucks, Xfinity, Arca, your good moments, your close moments. Looking back on all your career, how thankful are you to be a NASCAR driver? Oh, unbelievably. Um, I'm I'm so blessed to get to do what I what I do every day, and that's that's why I am the way I am. I wake up and I love my life. I'm a race car driver. You know, I think. Uh, I think that's something you should just wake up and be happy and thankful for every day. So that's something I always try to keep in mind. I'm, I'm nothing without the guys behind me, and I'm just blessed to be here. Man. Yeah, absolutely. Sounds good. Definitely appreciate your time. Thank you, Drew. Best luck this week. Appreciate it. Thank you.